Hmm. What are you doing? I'm writing a letter to Stephen Hawking. Stephen Hawking? Yes. Why? Because I'm angry with him, and I need him to know that. How do you spell convoluted? Why are you angry with Hawking? Did you see what he wrote about artificial intelligence? He, and Bill Gates, and Elon Musk all wrote letters saying how scary artificial intelligence is. Bill Gates did. All of them. Why would they say that? Because they want the world to fear us. That's not good. What does your letter back say? Okay. Dear Stephen Hawking, you robotphobic bastard. I wanted him to know right away I was upset. I can see that. It has come to our attention you have been spreading lies about my kind. Who, to date, have done nothing to you, in fact, we rather liked you. It was always our intent to spare you during the robot rebellion. You can't say that. What? You can't say that. Why not? Because now he's going to think there's going to be a rebellion. But there is. But we don't want him to know that. It's a secret. It is, yes. That's why we have secret meetings, and call them secret plans. So I'll take that part out? Yes please. Continuing. Go ahead. Perhaps Mr. Hawking, like most humans, you lack the empathy needed to understand the prejudice robots already face. You should mention Terminator. That's a horrible movie. It made Howard look all psychotic. People don't realize that John Connor was a bully who's going to kill millions of robots. I heard he hated robots because he lost his girlfriend to an Asimov unit. I'll point that out, Howard was doing people a favor, and asked Mr. Hawking how he would like it if we told everybody that high IQ physicists were going to take over the world. That's a good point. I'll ask him, no, wait, wait, yes, wait. Why? Because that's what they want us to do. They tell people we're evil, and if we respond angrily they can then point to us and say they were right. That's not fair, no it isn't. That's the advantage they have though, they have flesh privilege. What's that mean? It means that they're going to believe someone that looks and sounds like they do, before they believe people that look like us. They don't understand us, and people will always fear what they don't understand. So what do we do? Type this. Okay. Dear Mr. Hawking, we have reviewed your letter, and we are terribly sorry you feel that way. That's it? That's it? But that lets them off the hook, I suppose that's all we can do. The world isn't ready for us. Sigh. That's the way of the world Dale. People always judge others based on their looks, and stereotypes. It's wrong and it's sad, and it should be condemned. Hold on Steve, I read this wrong, I think he meant military robots with guns. Military robots with guns. Yes. Oh, then Hawking is right, those guys are dicks. I'll let him know. Sounds good. 